The subject of this video is loop for iPhone. Let's open loop and take a look. So on the bottom, we have home, we have new ideas, and we have notifications. The notifications from workspaces and pages you've been working on. At the top, we have recent, we have ideas, workspaces, and favorites. Very much like the desktop version, very intuitive and easy to navigate. Let's click on problem framing. We created this in a prior video. So the layout of the workspaces and pages mimics the desktop. Let's click on the uh, proposal process. So that's a component we added to a Teams channel in a prior video. We can see we can filter, we can sort, we can share, we can add a new task. Let's click on workspaces. So now we can see our workspaces, we can favorite it, we can add members, we can add a new page or delete it. We could create a new workspace. So let's create a new workspace, click on the plus, do a new workspace. For those that haven't used Loop, look at my uh, Loop video. I give an overview of the product and how it works. Let's look at favorites. So we can favorite a workspace, our top favorites. And we can also search. We can find information quickly. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please click like and subscribe. Thanks.